Hello guys, this video is about how to properly install ProJoy Rapid Shutdown device, which we call it ISD. ProJoy provides string level and module level ISD. And we divided the module level into DC 24 volts and PLC version, along with control boxes as additional accessories to control ISD. Our ISD can be adapted to all types of modules on the market. The DC 24V series ISD comes with three types, which is 1-in-1, 2-in-1, and 4-in-1. Each of them has different wiring methods. In order to avoid misoperation, you need to pay special attention and identify the conductor wire types. The outline is used to connect inverters. PV wire is used to connect the modules. 24 volts control wire is to connect the control box. This is DC 24 volts 1 in 1 type ISD. As you can see, the PV wire is the shortest among all and labeled with positive and negative mark. Using the positive side to connect the module wire, vice versa. This is out wire. When you need to connect the multiple ISD, simply connect the positive wire of one ISD with the negative of the other. This is the 24 volts control wire. Please note that only the 24 volts control wire is a two core harness. Simply connect the 24 volts wire of one ISD with the next, and so on, to achieve multiple ISD connection. In the end, connect the remaining 24 volts wire to the DC port of the control box. The AC port of the control box is used to connect to the grid. This is DC 24 volts 2 in 1 type ISD. Its 24 volts control wire comes with two core harnesses. For the PLADAS type, when connected its PV port to the port of module wires, using the positive side of PV1 wire to connect the positive side of module, and the PV1 negative connects the negative side of the same module, applying the same method to connect the PV2 wire with another module. As for the PL120 S type, first connect the two modules in series, and then connect the remaining wires of the modules to the PV wires of the ISD. This is DC 24 volts 4 in 1 type ISD. Its 24 volts control wire both comes with two core harnesses. The shorter one is PV wire. At first, connected each pair of modules in series, then connected the remaining wires of the modules to the PV wires of the ISD. That's it. This is PL series repeat shutdown devices. Comes with two different types. For PL ADP11, when connecting two modules, using the positive side to connect the positive side of the module wire, vice versa. As for the PLADP21 type, using the positive side of PV1 wire to connect the positive side of module, and the PV1 negative connects the positive side of the same module. Applying the same method to connect the PV2 wire with another module. When connecting it to an inverter, connect the out wire of one ISD with the inverter. Then combine multiple ISDs together by connecting the positive wire of one ISD with the negative of the other. In case if you needed to use a PLC control box, connect the remaining out wire to the box. The DC positive port of the control box is used to connect the inverter and AC port to the grid. The stainless steel mounting clips on the back of the product 
is designed to make it easier to snap onto the back frame of the motors. Built in with advanced real-time temperature monitoring sensor, it will sensor when the temperature exceeds 85 centigrade and cut off the current between the PV module and the inverter within 30 seconds. In case of emergency, the current can also be cut off by turning off the control box manually. ProJoy provides a full series of module-level ISD to meet the application requirements in different scenarios. As one of ProJoy's star products, it will always keep your PV system safe and under control. Thank you.